Lottie Moss, Kate Moss's younger half-sister, revealed on social media why she got a face tattoo. Lover is inked on the model's left cheek. OnlyFans creator, who has previously spoken about her struggles with anxiety and substance abuse, talks about the tattoo in an interview with Glamour UK. As a result of rehab, I have been on a journey of self-discovery. I've spent a lot of time in Bali, surrounded by nature, reading alone or spending time with like-minded people, and learning to love myself again while finally being free from my former life," she explained. That's why I decided to get my face tattoo. The word, lover, under my eye, she continued. Yes, it was impulsive, but after years of being so controlled, it was my way of expressing that I am free. I'm no longer controlled. However, the model appeared to have a bit of hesitation about the permanent ink as well, admitting that she had too much to drink and considering her choices the morning after. She documented her new tattoo on TikTok, saying, This could have gone without doing, but I actually don't mind it, so it's here to stay. We'll learn to love it. The world will learn to love it. I hope my mom will learn to like it, before concluding, don't drink alcohol, kids. She also posted other glimpses at the ink on TikTok in a video caption, waking up with a tattoo on my face, showing a close-up of the text. The voiceover jokes, I win the Silly Billy Awards. She responded to, people who don't like my face tattoo, with, I don't care. I don't give a damn. No, I don't. As a commenter wrote, back on the gear I see, she replied, good one. No, I'm not high. Other followers were divided about the look, some telling her it looks cool and badass, while another pointing out that the letters almost look like they spell loser. The tattoo talk comes as the model is embroiled in a discussion surrounding Nepo babies. I'm so sick of people blaming nepotism for why they aren't rich and famous or successful, she vented on social media as a response to the release of New York Magazine's Hollywood nepotism cover, although she was not mentioned in the viral article.